So guys, for the first method, if you're using a VPN or proxy, then you want to disable it. See if that works. For the second method, you want to head over to search and type in troubleshoot settings. Click on it. And now once you're on this, you want to click on other troubleshooters. And now you want to find network and internet. Click on run. And now this will come up, the network and internet troubleshooter. If it detects any problems with your network, it will try to fix it for you. See if that works. For the next method, you want to head over to search and type in view network connections. Click on it. And now once you're on this, you want to find your network adapter. Double click on it. And then click on properties. And then click on internet protocol version 4. Make sure that you have the default options selected. So obtain an IP address automatically, you want to select that. And now under it, you want to select obtain DNS server address automatically as well. So just keep this on the default options and then click on OK. For the last method, you want to head over to search and type in CMD. Now you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. And now once we're on this, we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS and then click on enter. And now we're going to type in netsh space windsock space reset and then click on enter again. And now you just want to restart your computer and then hopefully this will not fix your problem. You could also try uninstalling and then reinstalling 5M.